Hey guys, what's up? This is adam 4 fxd79.com Today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone or iPod Touch or iPad uh, with 4.0 software installed. Um, the jailbreak is here. It's Red Snow 0.9.5. Uh, you can get this in the description. Just download it. Doesn't need to be installed. Uh, open it up just like this. Uh, hit browse. Then find your software. Um, it should, if you have it installed by iTunes, it'll be under uh, at uh, your name. App data, roaming, Apple computer, iTunes, and then uh, iPod software updates, and that'll be in the description. Or you can download it. There's a site, uh, Felix Bruns, where you can download it, uh, which is a really awesome site. So you can get it from there, and that'll also be in the description. So just hit open. It'll process the firmware. Uh, it'll ask if there's if it's an MC model. Um, mine isn't, but you can check by going to Settings General and then About and then scroll down to the model number and it will tell you it'll say like mine is MB something a bunch of numbers um, but yeah so if it's an MC don't jailbreak you might have to restore it um, so yeah mine isn't so I'll hit no hit next it's gonna uh, patch the firmware file the IPSW file and also download some things from their servers that need to be installed on it. Um, and then you're going to check install Cydia, enable multitasking, home screen wallpaper, and battery percentage. Um, you can do this stuff, but I just don't really care. Uh, so, yeah. Um, hit next. And then I'm going to set this down. Uh, you're going to need your iPod to be off. So I'm going to set this down here so I can show you guys what I'm doing. Uh, in terms of pressing buttons and stuff. Um... And just go ahead and hit next. I'm gonna hold down the home button for three seconds. Now hold that. Add the um, or sorry, hold down the power button and hold down the uh, home button when it starts when it tells you to. Don't let go of the power button. And then let go of the power button and only hold the home button. And it should recognize soon that we're putting this into DFU mode and it should just start jailbreaking. There we go. And it's now safe to uh, release all the buttons. Your iPod screen will go right well white. And we'll go through several um, uh, jailbreaking stages. Um, it'll reboot, reboot a few times, and then it will start patching the kernel, and uh, you're good to go. So I'm gonna try and make this all in one video because I don't really don't have time to edit anything today. Um, so I just want to upload this um, to show you guys how to do it because um, I'm about to leave for a trip, so there won't be a new video until around Monday or so. Um, but yeah, I wanted to show you guys how to do this before I leave. Um, and sometimes it gets stuck, but you just have to try it again. Um, it gets stuck at different parts. But um, <clears throat> anyways, <laughs> looks like it's not going to jailbreak for me. But uh, that's how you jailbreak it. Um, if it gets stuck, just try it again. I don't really have time to do that right now. Or, I'll do it, but I don't have time to show it to you guys. Um, but, that's how you jailbreak. It should just come up on the screen, uh, uh, downloading jailbreak data. Then, uh, it'll reboot, and your iPod will be jailbroken. You'll have Cydia, and from there, you can install Rock and uh, Winterboard and all that good stuff. But, the coolest thing is that you already have, um, you also have all those features, like background wallpaper. It'll just be like, you, you have an iPod Touch 3G. Like, they won't limit you to any of the stuff that you have on your 1G or 2G or, you know, iPhone 3G or whatever. So, uh, yeah. Uh, okay, so I guess it's stuck. But uh, I will try this again, and I will see you guys later. Peace.